All right, guys, so this isn't necessarily just Funko Pop related. This is going to be kind of Funko Pop related, anime related. Like I tell you, I'm going to bring anime content to the channel. But I had to tell y'all before, you know, y'all go into the video. We're going to check out this spot called Anime Pop. And we're going to see what they have for the boy. Uh, I believe I've been to one uh, that's located in Addison, kind of closer to where I live. But we're at the one in Austin. We got to see what they have. They might have some mango on sale or something. We, the boy needs to see what he could get. So let's go. All right, guys, so it's time for me to give you my final thoughts on what I thought about the store. Now, the name of the store is called Anime Pop. There's a location within Addison, and I went to the location within Austin. Like I said, there's only two locations. I actually met the store owner of the Austin one. Pretty cool dude. He was obviously willing to let me record in there. So if you let me record, I don't think you're a cool dude. But I got to say thank you first and foremost to him because he gave me the opportunity to record and I'm very grateful for that opportunity. The Instagram for this store will be in the description below as well. Now, what I think about the store, it's pretty good. Now, I'm not a big anime collector. Okay, well, I'm not a big like anime statue and figure collector. Like y'all see the Funko Pops back there, but that's like all the anime like memorabilia I collect besides manga issues too. Now, I did get one thing. I was on broke boy status when I went there, but I did get one thing. <sighs> Beautiful, ain't it? So I recently started rewatching Yu Yu Hakusho, and if you follow me on Instagram, you will know as well because, well, I've been rewatching it, and I want to get all my pops on, like I said it previously in my uh, ECCC haul video. If you want to see that video, click that top left card if you're on mobile. But yeah, I'm into collecting manga issues, and I really just want to get all the Yu Yu Hakusho's. I'm already collecting Dragon Ball Super, Dragon Ball Z, a little bit of Naruto, and Mob Psycho and One Punch Man. So now that I'm on a new journey of collecting manga too, I'm killing myself.
But let me know what you guys think about the store. Let me know if you guys will ever go to the store if you are in the Texas, Dallas, Austin area. Like I said, the store owners are cool. The statues and figures, pretty good price. Uh, they're not being upcharged or anything. I think they're worth the price that you pay for them. They even had Nenderoids. And if you watch Drew's vids, like I've been doing recently, which I shouldn't because he's a bad influence. He's a very bad influence because you watch his vids and you see them Nenderoids, you're going to want to buy one too. But like I said, they had a lot of anime memorabilia. You could buy stuff. You could buy manga, statues, figurines, all type of stuff. They didn't really have that many pops, which I wasn't, you know, too focused on. I was just looking at the anime store, but it's weird that you call it anime pop. But let me know if you guys like the store. Tell me if you guys like these type of videos. Another episode of Come Shop with the Boy. And I know y'all see these packages back here. I see them too. I will be unboxing these later this week. Uh, just want to get one to two more packages and I will be good. But I'd like to say thank you guys for watching. If you're already not a returning viewer side subscriber, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you, blah, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you like Funko Pop content, anime content, Dragon Ball Z content. You got it here if you hit that subscribe button and i gotta say welcome back to all my returning viewers and subscribers and i gotta be thankful for y'all because y'all holding the boy down right now also if you haven't already go ahead and hit that like button for your boy that way you won't forget and i highly appreciate it it helps the channel grow in ways that i don't know thirdly if you haven't already go ahead and follow me on instagram the link will be in the description below and i have a public discord for collectors and nerds all alike but i'd like to say thank you guys for watching dark sage out peace